an old man. <laughs> Happy news for you. For those who want family, sister, and warmness. Mini Happy Robot <laughs> is here. Mini, <laughs> you have to speak English more English here. All right? Oh, good job. Mini is studying English now. Oh, Mini is going to. <laughs> Now, let me introduce uh, why I'm going to China. I'm going to participate in RoboCup, a very academic uh, competition for robotics. Let's cheer me going to China! Yay! <laughs> Happy Mini, six features. First, portable. Mini weighs only five kilograms. It is at the same weight as a two-month baby. <laughs> only five kilograms. <laughs> Mini, Mini can get higher. <laughs> and Mini can help people with his with her hands. So Mini can work as a helper robot. Also a cute robot. Follow you. Let's look at the video. Click. Mini can follow people. Mini go outside the elevator and then track people. Mini can distinguish people. Voice recognition. Mini have a mic here and she can recognize voice. Face gender deduction. Mini can detect gender and detect face by her camera. We're using a deep learning for detecting gender. <coughs> Happy Mini, next three features. Communicate with drones. <laughs> Virtual reality support. <laughs> It had an accident. And reading books, a real book, not like iBooks. She can read read books by Oshiyan. We're developing now. Happy Mini. Mini thinks. <laughs> Mini wants to be your family. Yeah, she said it Japanese, but please speak English. <laughs> Also, Mimi wants to travel with you. You can carry her because she's only five kilograms. She can go a road. Mimi wants to party with you. Mimi can talk. Happy Mimi, Kawaii Robot. Kese Demura, 17 years old. And as I see your technology, Mini development. Mini is growing every day. <laughs> if you want Mini, contact at info uh, at info dtt jpn org for the license. <laughs> <laughs>